update. A week ago today, the stepmother convicted of killing her 14-month-old stepdaughter has been released on bond after being granted a retrial. In an exclusive 12 News interview, the family of the late toddler, Jariah Smith, speaks out against the Claiborne County judge who tried the case. 12 News, Anthony Howard has the story. Anthony. The family accuses Judge Tamika Irving of being biased in the case of the state of Mississippi versus Takiya Beverly. They feel the judge may have had a personal connection to, Takiya, to the Beverly family, inhibiting her ability to fairly try this case. She shouldn't have ever been over this case. After serving only eight months of a life sentence for the murder of her stepdaughter, Takiya Beverly is out on bond. I do not feel like that's fair at all, but that's, a, that's another thing with the judge. Deidreana Smith says she recently discovered that Claiborne County Judge Tamika Irving had a personal relationship with the Beverly family. The judge was supposed to accuse herself from this case because she knew Mr. Beverly, Mr. Morris's father. That's a conflict of interest right there. The family of 14-month-old Jariah says the judge and the Beverly family all attend the same church. If you're assuming that a juror is related to, you know, an extended family member of Jariah, then it's safe for us to assume that your father or father-in-law who pastors a church whose co-pastor is the defendant's father, you all knew each other. Takia Beverly was granted a retrial and bond eligibility after it was determined juror 24 was related to the family of the victim. I feel like they were looking for anything just to give this girl a retrial, right. and they did. Relatives of the victim believe the relationship between the judge and the Beverly family caused her to be lenient with the case. In the history of this court's existence, there has never been a bond given to a capital murder. Never. In the history of this court's existence, there has never been a retrial granted. There has never been a case overturned ever in the history of Claiborne County Justice Court. It's my feelings because I feel like Jariah life didn't matter. That's all they care about was Takia. What about Jariah? She's the one who's not here. And we want justice again. Now, the family also believes the, the relationship between the judge and the Beverly family is the reason Morris Beverly, the father of Jariah, doesn't have a scheduled trial date. I reached out to Judge Irving, but she has not been available for comment at this time. Melanie? Anthony, thank you. To another update, the man charged in the 2019 death.